Are you a Christian, brother? Are you a non-Muslim? I'm a non-Muslim. Okay, what's your name and your profession, brother? Okay, my name is Benson Sunday, and I'm a software engineer. Okay, my question goes thus. Um, I, I'd like to give you a little background of my question, if you like, which is that um, I should have also be a Muslim today, if not for this question that is not answered. And what is the question? The question sorry, sorry. Is can you repeat again, brother? Okay. Can you say a bit loudly and slowly? Um, I think the speakers are not good yet. It's not your fault. It's the fault of the speakers. Good. Can you repeat the question? I said, in the year 2008... Let, let me, brother. In the, yes. year, in the year 2008, probably I might have been a Muslim. In the year 2008, you might have been a Muslim. Because, but because of this question that... I could not get an answer for, okay. and maybe some other one, but this was a very crucial one for me. But now if you get the answer, you'll become a Muslim, inshallah. Just wait. Uh, if you could answer it, no problem. And the question goes like this. What is the question, brother? The question is that being a, being a Christian, I discovered to go to paradise is just to believe in Jesus Christ and follow him and you get to paradise. Now, but after a friend bought me a Quran in 2007-2008, and we start reading, I begin to, I found out in some references that all Muslims will first of us go to hellfire and be born in hellfire before. Sorry, can you repeat all Muslims will? All Muslims. Can you keep quiet, brothers and sisters? They are reference to these things. I am not saying can it. You this be is quiet, from the please? Quran. And from their deeds. Wait, uh, I cannot hear you. What is the use of you speaking when I cannot hear you? No, no, no. Please wait. Brothers, sisters, if you, if you want to stop the program, we'll stop it. Do you want to stop the program? No. So please keep quiet. When someone is posing a question, please keep quiet. When there is time to clap, you can clap. When there is time to say takbir, say takbir. Rest of the time, please keep silent. Jazakallah shukran. Yes, brother. Okay, so I repeat that after studying it in that 2007, 2008, I find out some Quranic references and um, Adits also explain it. Some Adits, even Soyi Hadiths, which are strong Adits, um, that no, all Muslims will taste hell. They will pass through hell before they get to paradise. And I, being a Christian, I look at it that... How can I? Okay, how can I have an offer that says go to paradise directly without air fire? And one say you have to go through fire with uh, and after that you go to paradise. Even some some uh, at this even says that the prophet I heard your question. I got your question. Okay. Is that your question? Uh, just a, a last one to that question. That some some at this even shows that the prophet himself says in some places that even him, when, it, when everybody is born in the um, fire of hell, it remains the mark of worship and Allah will shovel some people out of it. And even him is not sure if he will be among those who will be shoveled out and same, same water will pour on it. So, I heard your question. I heard your question and understood very clearly. Okay. Finish, you have too long. You want to give a speech here? No, no, no. I so, understood your question, hundred percent. So I should, I should, I should. Yes, I want to answer it now. Okay, thank you, sir. The brother said that, it, and I'll repeat your question in short. Thank you. The brother said in 200, 2008, he would have become a Muslim. He was going to become Muslim, but he read the Quran. And the Quran says, all the Muslims will first go to hell. After hell, then they will go to heaven. And even the Prophet himself will first go to hell. Brother, this is the Quran. Where does it say this? You are telling all nonsense. Okay, can I, I, I quote the, the Can I quote the reference? Listen, listen, listen. I have the reference, sir. Okay, give the reference. Okay, first of all, you no, have no, it in give the Quran. Reference. Wait, give yes. the reference where it says all Muslims will go to hell first. Where, where does it say? Okay. I you, have read the Quran 100 times, more than 100 times. You may not hear it in that same word, but I'll quote it. Give Quran chapter 19. Give me the reference. Give me the reference. Surah to Maryam. Sorry, Surah Maryam, chapter number 19. Yes. Verse number 68 to 72. I think emphasis wait, wait, is wait, wait, in wait. 71. Chapter 19. Yes. Surya Mariam. Verse number? Shh. Will you all keep quiet? Will you all behave yourself? 
if you all don't know how to behave yourself when a non muslim is asking a question on the quran and you all are screaming shame on you shame on you a non muslim wants to know about the quran he wants to accept islam and you all are shouting what's happened to the muslim umma yes maryam so to maryam what's ayah 68 to 72 68 to 72 68 okay and there's another reference also but we we'll start with that where does it say okay where does it say all muslim will be put to hell 71 if you can read it and i can read from here or anybody can bring an english quran we can read it 68 to 71 if you have if anybody have i have the quran on my phone but if you want them to bring a physical quran with english i can come no i'm it. english english arabic i've got both arabic and english both yes that's so what i'm saying is a mistake 71. i can check up in that way where the 71 say muslim will go to hell uh, okay. Does... okay can you read it or i should read it from here so that okay. we can no where where the word muslim mentioned here for show me which i have mentioned muslim it is talking about somebody else it's talking about the evil one who will go to hell first mm. where does it say muslims okay let me read if if that's not convincing no, let me read tell me which verse says muslim yes let me verse, read it let me read it number, out okay let me yes. verse number okay good let me let me read it out verse number which eh, let me let me check and which verse out. are you reading i want to know 71 72 so, in 71 72 the word muslim doesn't exist okay, okay read now uh, uh, then let me read from six that's why i quote my reference is from 68 okay 68 also doesn't good oh yeah let 68 me read it doesn't say muslim anywhere let me read let me read even i can read from anywhere any any place okay from 66 okay and man says 66 now okay can it be that when i am dead i will be brought alive does man not remember that when created him earlier when he was nothing Correct. but your lord we will surely aid them and the devil and the and the devil repeat devil devil yes, yes devil yes. for last talking about devils now and the devil yes. then we will surely bring them around hell on their knees correct then out of every set we will surely snatch those most defiant to to the all merciful no no read correctly you are reading half read correctly again that verse this is this is from my own Then read 68 the, read 68 again no okay i'm reading 69 now i've read 68 before 68 says so thy says, lord uh, but read. okay sorry sorry but your lord we will, will surely aid them and the devil devil yes yes then we will surely bring them around hell on their knees okay and i Next. continue 69 Then out of every set we will surely snatch those most defiant to the all merciful. Correct. All those who are against Allah. Yes. So it's not talking about Muslims. Uh, we are it's still talking reading. about those who are against Allah. We have not finished sir. We have not finished no, sir. So read the full verse correctly. Read 69. 70, Then can we certainly 70. drag out from every sect all those who were worst in obstinate rebellion against Allah most gracious. Yes I said so this was this talking about those who are Allah at, most gracious I didn't not about Muslims no let me continue let me read the Quran first But before first, you give an explanation let me read the so Quran so do you understand talking about those who are against Allah Sheikh Zaknaik let me read the Quran Al Quran this is the Al Quran let me read Al -Quran. it con completely yes. first yes. before you give explanation so 70 76 then we surely know better of those who are most deserving to roast in it to okay but every single one of That's you is born to approach it this has been a decree unavoidable decree of your lord the, the then we will deliver those who were mindful of god and live on just in the on their knees so Very if good. you if you can read that even in your own English I'm you reading that it will, it will I'm it. reading Arabic also no. and English also uh, no one does it say Muslim okay. it's talking about the devil and those who are followers of the devil who are enemies of Islam in, correct uh, that's why I said read it say Muslim read in the full it. Arabic text there is no Muslim okay in no the more. English text there is no Muslim okay why are you I trying mean. to fool the people no but no sir the Hadith explain it better we said if you did not get it I can give another Quran I'm not getting it 
I can understand even in your language. No way the word Muslim mentioned. Even in your English language, it's talking about the devil and those who are obstinate against the most gracious Allah. Okay. So Allah will bring them and put them in hell. What is now, the problem? But why did he say that? Please don't waste people's time. You no, read, sir. you took so much time. I gave you time. You, no, you can, can quote you can in the Quran. It. You can read it from your translation. Even, even what you read, the word Muslim is not there. You, you, it doesn't have to have be Muslim. He's saying all sects. Of sex. course it should. Saying all sects of all the devil. People. He's talking all about sex you, of all the devil. Being. And also the Hadith. Okay, let me read the Hadith so that it can be clearer. And another Quranic verse that make it clear. Another Quranic verse. Quran chapter 3, verse 185. Quran chapter 3, verse 185. Also yeah, make it clear. I know 3, 185 says, Allah will not accept any religion except Islam. All those who follow any other religion, they shall be put into hell. Now, from here, I, I want to read it. I want to just read it. I'm telling and, and And I'll just, we'll just read the Hadith to, to, to confirm it. It doesn't, doesn't say Muslims. It is talking about those who are against Allah. Anyone who desires a religion other than Allah, it will never be accepted of him. Kullu nafsin zaykatul maut. Every soul shall have a taste of death. I, I, I'm reading here. Then we read the Now, brother, you are close to accepting Islam. I think it's a story. It's a story. It's a story because you wanted to misguide the people brother what's your name brother what's your name my name is benson benson yes benson yes brother benson i doubt whether you wanted to accept islam in 2008 i want to my Very best good. friend let, let me let me give you a, a narration about it my best friend with a muslim i'm a christian we share everything in common is the one that we discovered that the only thing we didn't share in but common. now do you know you made a mystery your friend may not be an expert in the quran correct my, my friend is a christian today 2012, he has become a Christian and is oh, an affair. Your friend, friend, your friend, according to that, the reason your friend that told you doesn't know the Quran and you misguided him. No, so you he misguided instead himself. of him taking you to Islam, you took him from the right path to the wrong path. I told you first, your friend doesn't know the Quran, you misguided him, and now you're trying to misguide us also. Correct? No, sir. So if you told your friend I want to become Muslim and show you the Quran, now Quran says you'll go to hell, now become a Christian, he became a Christian because he doesn't know the Quran. Brother, I'm talking to you, you're looking inside. Okay, I want to just read it. I'm That's talking right. to you, you're looking inside. Okay, no, what I'm listening this? to you, sir. I, brother, you quoted two verses. Both the verses don't talk about Muslims in hell. Why are you wasting your time? Do, do you want to? You have to agree you made a mistake, say sorry and let's. Let us give a chance to her, please. Okay, sir. Do if you, you make a mistake, say sorry at least. No, say at least sorry. No. Say sorry, I made a mistake. No, I didn't make any mistake. Okay, then, then don't accept your mistake. Then you're a liar according to me. Okay, thank you. Yes. Can we have the next question, sister?